the tomboy who was changed into a real boy. There was a little girl, the daughter of an earl, you perceive no rank or station, is from faults free-free, who played with all the boys, was so rude and fond of noise, that what happened to her presently will see, see, see. When winter brought the ice, she stood not over nice, but in the park with Ralph and George went sliding, sliding, sliding. Did an organ or a drum, or a man or monkey come, within sound she would after them go striding, striding, striding. She would join them at football, she would mount a tree or wall, to seek birds' nests, and would jump over ditches, ditches, ditches. But at works of skill and grace, she held the lowest place, and was very far from clever at her stitches, stitches, stitches. At last she grew so coarse, e'en her voice was rough and hoarse, and her attitudes became so like a boy's, 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 that they thought it only right, on a certain summer's night, to change her sex completely, without noise, noise, noise. So a sailor she was made, and a ship's captain was paid, quite quietly to take her off to sea, sea, sea. Where for anything I know, this said tomboy may be now, and a caution may it prove to you and me, me, me. It's okay to be a tomboy. Silence, Victorian!